This is the most anti-people government I've ever seen in Nigeria. Anyway, they weren't brought in by the people. They were brought in by technical glitch. From this time forth, nobody can ever technical glitch my elections. These were the words of Mr. Kenneth Okonkwo. So guys, we all know that Peter Obi had an interactive session in Abuja last weekend. And Kenneth Okonkwo and Aisha Yusufu, they shook the environment. Let me just allow you to listen to what both of them said during this occasion. Take your time to watch this video. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and share your thoughts in the comment section below. The things that destroy us are politics without principles. Wealth without work, knowledge without character. Why would I not follow a man in the midst of his generation is a man of competence? <laughs> <laughs> because men are men of wealth without work. Politics without principles. I don't tell you that we remove oil subsidy, punishing the people. They are paying one premium subsidy every month to them. Why? Why punish the people? They told you they have placed sanctions on the other countries. Today they have removed it. Why did you punish all the northern states? This is the most anti people government I've ever seen in my life. But I have one joy. They were not brought in by the Nigerian people. Yeah. They were brought in through technical glitch. And you know what? From henceforth, nobody is going to technically glitch my election.
exactly we will say, yes, sir. Mr. Peter, we are not You know, we are not going to be tackled. We are not going to be saved. But some of us get to pronounce here. We know this here. guys for those who think that yes because peter will be no more the praise so guys for those who think that because peter will be was not declared the winner of the last election that maybe obedient family will have no place in nigeria any longer you can see that that is far from the reality i tell you obedient movement has come to stay and there's no two ways about it because nigerians are tired of you know these old school politicians that we have who do not even understand the plights of the people and for those who even have knowledge of what nigerians are going through they don't have the willpower you know to help the people so we want politicians who are credible who have character you know who can stand the test of time who do not have corruption allegations around them we want people of character to come into politics so that the lives of uh, nigerians and the future of nigeria as a country will be better so guys and that is just what peter will be is doing in nigeria today you can see that the obedient movement is getting stronger and bigger and you know people are getting to be convinced 
that this political class they really hurt nigeria a lot so it is time to get rid of them so guys i hope you enjoyed this video let me know what you think about it in the comment section below don't forget to subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell thank you